Hey everyone, Alex here for Bright Dog Academy. If you'd like me to personally answer any questions you may have about your dog, be sure to head over to brightdog.com where you can learn about my online training program, plus pick up a copy of the official Bright Dog Academy ebook. Are human pain medications safe for dogs? A lot of dog owners ask me this question, and it's a very good question because it seems like it would be a very easy fix when your dog has a problem, throw them some Advil, throw them some Tylenol, aspirin, whatever, and it'll help them relieve their pain, just like it helps with humans. The truth is though, this can be very dangerous and sometimes fatal. So first let's talk about aspirin. Is aspirin safe to give to our dogs? A small dog, medium dog, big dog? The quick answer is no, it's not. When dogs consume aspirin, it can actually cause ulcers to form in the dog's stomach and that can really mess up with the dog's digestive system. Besides the problems with the dog's stomach, it can also cause kidney issues. A large enough dose of aspirin can actually cause complete kidney failure in dogs. Now, here's the one exception. If you've calculated the dog's weight and height, taken into account their health history, um, you think about the current shape they're in, and you use baby aspirin, then sometimes it can be okay. If you do that though, the dose has to be carefully measured, exact, exact, exact. There's no too much, a little bit too much is gonna cause problems. So the dose has to be uh, measured perfectly and it's only for a very short period of time that you do that. Now, I'm not gonna tell you guys you know, how much uh, you should be, what the calculations are because you need to consult your vet for figuring out how much baby aspirin would be safe for your dog. Every single dog is different. Like I said, there's so many factors that goes into it. So regular aspirin, no, you never give it to your dog. Baby aspirin, can it be an option? Yes, but only with approval from your vet and with your vet, you know, figuring out how much is a safe dosage for your dog. Another medication people wanna know about is ibuprofen. Much like the aspirin, Short answer, no, it's not safe for dogs. In fact, ibuprofen is even more dangerous to dogs than aspirin is. Dogs that eat it can have the same effects, the same side effects as aspirin, the stomach uh, issues, the ulcers, um, kidney issues, and it can actually lead to death. So it needs to be avoided at all times. So now you know it's not good to purposely give these medications to our dogs, right? But what if our dog accidentally ate one of them? Here are the signs to look for that lets you know possibly your dog might have some kind of medication poisoning. The first thing to look for is vomiting. If you come home and you realize that, you know what, I had five aspirin on the counter and now they're not there anymore. Maybe my dog jumped up there and ate them and you notice that your dog is vomiting and especially if there's blood in the vomit, that could be a sign that he's been poisoned by one of those medications. A few other signs could be lack of appetite, fatigue. If your dog starts acting lethargic, those could also be signs that he's been poisoned. Now, remember I said that it causes, uh, these medications can cause problems in the dog's stomach. Well, when a dog, his, a dog's stomach is in pain, they will actually hunch over like this and, to try to ease the pain in because it's hurting. So if you see a, your dog in that position, that's another sign that there could be a stomach issue. Maybe it's not necessarily the poison, uh, they're not poisoned by the Advil or uh, aspirin. Um, it's just, that's just something to good to know in general that when you see a dog hunched over, it could be a stomach problem. But if we're talking about this, that, that could be a sign. Worst case scenario, a dog that's eaten, you know, an entire bottle, okay? Signs you could see may be seizures or even coma. Bottom line, human medications are not safe for dogs. If you have a dog that's in pain, okay, call your vet, number one. Even just call the emergency vet. Most of the emergency vets will give you advice over the phone. You know, they're not gonna give you a full diagnosis, but you call and say, hey, my dog, I think my dog's in pain, what should I do? Sometimes they might say, okay, let me, you know, get the weight, the age, the height, everything, and okay, you can give them some baby aspirin, that'll help. And if not, sometimes they can actually just write you prescriptions because there's specific medications that are that work for dogs and have been tested for dogs and that we know are safe for dogs and will relieve the pain. So keep your human medication locked up away from the dogs. And next time you think your dog is in pain, don't try to treat it yourself, give your vet a call. All right guys, thanks for watching. If you like this video, hit that subscribe button. And if you have any questions about your dog or wanna ask me questions about something related to dogs, feel free to head over to my website, links in the uh, description below, and you can ask me whatever you'd like.